You're really close. She's really close to me, and it's unnerving. Oh, we're gonna die. Jesus Christ. Oh, God, I, I think I peed a little. <laughs> She's so close to my face. I need an adult. Welcome back to another episode of Nessie Bang Bang. In the last episode, we did some Bach Bataling and cleared out a bunch of these little pathways along the, what we call that, Central Southwest Coast. Um, there is still more. There is still more, but I think we put a pretty good dent in it. And we ended up back in the Checkpoint Rest Town, which I think puts us in an excellent position to clear out this upper northwest corner. Oh, oh, not that way. Oh, I'm so confused. Why am I dumb? A scrap store. Scraps of what? Sorry, I'm like, oh, can you put on a shirt? I'm mighty uncomfortable. We did get the trickster one. <gasps> it's the one with the sensor. I'm just gonna say it. The starting gear looks like doo-doo. Phantasms to confuse foes. Damn. What's that? You ate my shield? Hate that for you. Oh, this was a mistake. Oh dear. Well. Now that's not fair! <laughs> that's, that's not fair! It should have shielded me! <sighs> I called BS on that one. I mean, going onto that cliff ledge, that was my poor decision for sure. But either the shield protects me for harm or it doesn't. It doesn't say that it only protects you from other people's damage. Hmm? Hmm. I've gobbled that. Bam. Yes. Time to say goodbye. And you can go too, because I get tired of trying to kill y'all. Y'all are annoying. Peace. You can tell me about your... We could move this boulder if we work together. Some Would anyone care to push? That's a lot of boulders. Are y'all for real right now? No! <laughs> I can't even be mad! I can't even be mad! But Kazu... I can't... I can't... I can't... What in the heck? There's... Let's talk about it. There's nobody up there but the pawns. Everything else was dead. So, I don't think they're funny. <laughs> okay, it's a little funny. <laughs> Need some Benny Hill music. Oh, biscuits. Gotta start over. I think there was explosives. It's just gonna be that kind of episode. Where I'm an idiot. And I need to accept that. Probably sooner rather than later. That's a dragon, y'all. What the hell? That's a dragon fighting a... There's a ballista arisen. Cyclops? Is it ready? How do you know? Oh, that's how. Oh my gosh, this is just like Skyrim and... Not Skyrim, oh my gosh. It's, it's like wonderful. Inquisition. When you come up on the, uh, the Storm Coast, right? And it's a dragon fighting the... Uh... Oh, it hit me back. It seems we have enraged our foe. Oh, great. That's that's perfect. Oh, he stepped on me. I don't think I'm ready for a dragon. No. Like, not even close. I don't know when I will be, but I don't think it's now. There, master. A drink. It's a drake? Like a baby dragon? Show me your power. I don't have any power, dude! Oh! As I poke it again.
Oh, just in time. Sorry, y'all. I'm forgetting to talk. This is just so intense. I'm trying to... Ooh, not quick enough. Oh dear. Oh, he's drooling. Oh, this is gonna be bad. He's about to zap me. Ooh, just in time. Okay, okay. We're doing things. What did he say? I don't know what you said. What did you say? I'm just gonna let my stamina come back for a minute. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh, wasn't much of my shield. Ah, oh, biscuits, I'm asleep again. Oh god! It's gonna be bad! It's gonna be bad! Woo! Are we actually gonna do this, y'all? Ah, shh. See, that's what I get. That's what I get for opening my mouth. Shields up! He's gonna smush me. He's gonna smush me. He's gonna smush me. He did. How did we live? I don't have a freaking clue. I, I'm gonna give you all the credit, Potter, cause it wasn't me. It wasn't me. Are you dead? Is it dead? Did we do it? Y'all. Y'all. Oh, I couldn't even breathe. Like my mouth was just hanging open. And apparently we got a specialty. Cool. <laughs> oh, but now I feel bad. They really are beautiful. But also you hit me first. You asshole. Is it ready? How do you know? Oh, that's how. Well, I don't know what to do now. I feel completely overwhelmed, underwhelmed, whelmed. I feel sad as... Big old bodies just sitting over there. And a campsite over there, that's good news. I feel sad. I'm glad I'm alive, but like, also sad. Man, even this music feels solemn and heavy. I mean, I know the dragon attacked me, and I know, and all the things, right? But it still feels kind of wrong. As the sun comes out in game. Okie dokie. I mean, how do you destroy something with so much grace and power and of such a size and not feel something? It doesn't quite. I, like, I'm super glad I'm not dead, but it also doesn't feel 100% like a victory. It's a tricky show. My heart knows no greater peace than when I am by your side. Can I mess with it? C cool. Thank, thank, thank you. This is all hell. Oh nope, shields up. Woo! Just in time. Oh no, there's another one. No, 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 no. Biscuits. Where'd your stupid head go? Take that, Fox! Boop. Boop. F your pots. Boop, 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 Woo! Still having feelings about that dragon. Oh, I suspect I will be for a minute. What? Well... Yeet! That's what you get for sitting in ruins. Yeah, think about that next time. I have just a thing for you, sir. And somebody lightning bolted them. Perfect. Nope. Nope. <laughs> I don't care that I can't loot it. I really do not. World Ascend Cavern. 
Oh, I didn't mean to kill the rat. Why can I kill the rat, but I can't pick the rat up and hug it? I have a problem, y'all. And it's looting. Oh my god, it's more stone. I know I don't have to pick it up. But y'all, it's loot. That looks like a sphinx. Oh. Ode to the Sphinx. O Sphinx, thou asked what hath four legs in the morn, two at noon and three at night from the answer is born, the means to claim a long sought boon. O Sphinx, what hast four legs in the morn, two at noon and three at night, which treasure would reward the one who leaveth it unmarked by sword? Whoops. O oh, Sphinx, four legs in the morn, two at noon, three a night, in the shrine thou awaits a challenger of wit to delight. I mean, isn't that man? Crawls and then walks upright and then walks with a cane? Mountain shrine. That is... That is more Sphinx stuff. Am I about to run into a Sphinx? Like, legit? I, you know, I don't know. I just feel kind of like I should save it. Because maybe a Sphinx is going to eat my face. Hello. It is. Whoa, she looks super creepy. Okay, okay. I don't, that looks like something that could eat my face, y'all. I mean, I know we just finally took out a dragon, but. Housekeeping? come to take my life. I, no, why, what happened to your nipples? Um, no? Man, she looks cool, though. I want her hair. Are those feathers? Yes, queen. Many have tried, and as you can plainly see, all have failed. Okay. I would abandon any such fool ideas if I were you. Seriously, are her nipples stone? That's weird. Does she have eyelids? I don't know. This is freaking me out. After all. That which is won by brute force is apt to be lost to the same. Well said. Perhaps I might interest you in a game of wits instead. Perhaps I might lose because I'm kind of an I idiot for today. You a simple task. Solve my riddles to satisfaction. Can we start with the the leg one? I know that one. Should your answers please me, I will bestow upon you the contents of yon chests. I trust I have your attention. I want to know if I get that key around your neck. I feel like I'm going to lose if this. So, take your place and we shall begin. Well, at least I have a hard save to go back to, I guess. Whoa, there's a lot of chests back there. Take my place. What is... The Sphinx's riddles are designed to baffle and confuse. I fear we pawns can be of little aid here, Master. No one? None of my pawns have gone I through this somewhere else? You, Whatever you decide. She's got a lot of chests. That's all I'm saying. Potter. Okay. Hold on. I gotta look at you first, lady. Is she gonna attack me if I go near the chest? Will they even open? I swear I'm not trying to look at her boobs, but look at her feet! Look at her little feeders! Look at her little murder mittens, y'all! Oh, she's so cute! And she got feathers on her tum-tums. And her creepy little peacock wings. And her banded tail. I feel like if I open it, she's going to attack me and there's going to be nothing in it. Dove is commendable. The fool beholds a sage in the mirror. The sage a fool. Which is it you see, I wonder? Do I have to actually answer that? Oh. Oh, there's lots of these. Oh, biscuits. Where's the riddle of the legs? Where's the riddle of the legs? I know that one. I'm scared and I want to cheat and look it up. I mean, I guess I could just keep reloading until I get it right, which let's be clear, I am not above doing. Frick. Our eyes are our allies. Yet oft do they betray. Okay. For eyes tell lies. So I advise and then you need a strength. Okay. Yet, 
How will your eyes advise you? Venture through yonder door and retrieve that which is of greatest value. Uh, of the greatest value, but that's wildly subjective. Oh, biscuits. Oh, I'm still holding him. Ow. I was like, where's the other body and why can't I loot it? Because I'm carrying it. That's a hole. I win. Oh, but almost fell through a hole. Well, he fell through a hole. What? A rotten apple. So am I supposed to bring the rotten apple? Or is that part of the trick? Oh, y'all, I don't know. But she said it's a riddle of eyes. And she said that our eyes betray us. I think I'm going to give her the rotten apple. The whole thing is set up like, don't trust your eyes and your eyes deceive you. In the sinks room, had a rotten apple in the chest, so I think that's the direction I'm gonna go. Like, I don't, oops, I don't know what else I'm gonna pick up down here for sure, but if she's into rotten apples, then so be it. Hey, another chest. I guess we give her the rotten apple, guys. This is no ordinary vessel. I wonder what tis intended to hold. I don't know why I'm stressing. I'm at a good place where I can reload it if I'm wrong. Come to test your wits. Yet, how would your eyes advise you? It doesn't give me any other option. I can't give her the apple. You're really close. So, this is your choice. The greatest worth your eyes describe. She's really close to me and it's unnerving. Oh, we're gonna die. Indeed, this is what I saw. Jesus Christ. Oh God, I, I think I peed a little. <laughs> She's so close to my face. I need an adult. No greater worth can there be than that found in simplicity. <sighs> I shall bestow it on your prize. Collect it from yon chest and take this file too. Its purpose I shan't divulge. How you use it is up to you. Okay. I think I'm just gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna drop a port crystal and I'm gonna go back and hard save it again, I think. Jesus Christ, she's scary. I was like, oh, she's super pretty. And then she got all, like, crazy cat-eyed on me. But I got to keep the vial, too, and that's... That's pretty cool. Oh, God, that was scary. She's scary. We're going back and hard saving it, kids. Mm-hmm. Um. It is done, Master. Now a fairy stone can whisk us here when... Let's not. Because the answer to get that was pretty simple. I can redo that easily. But my fairy stones... Are harder to replenish. Okay, crazy pants, let's do another. Come to test your wits. Love is as twin to madness, they say. They are bound fast as night is today. So bring forth your most beloved to me, that I might gauge the depth of your insanity. I don't like this. The most beloved. You can count on me to fly to your aid in your hour of need, Master. The Sphinx's riddles are designed to baffle it. I don't know how to do that exactly. The parent knows the child, yet the reverse is far from true. The child knows not the parent. Such is the parent's due. Okay. I am a lost child. For kinship do I yearn. Parent knows the child, but children don't really know their parents. She's a child. So bring to me my parent that I'm a griffin? Your wit. Life is an enigma, a lender of mortal debt. Yet lighter pack makes fleet of foot and chasso grant to me what you most prize. 
and thence elude your ponderous demise. It would probably be the port crystal. I don't want to give her my port crystal. Will she give it back? Oh, I don't know. Oh, shit. I have to give her something now. Can I cancel? Yes. You may hear my riddles as oft as you please. Okay. Is ever the first we keep fond in our breast? And ever the f you know of the seeker's tokens, I trust. Yet where was it that you found your first? Seven days, shall we say, ere you return? Okay. I I actually know where that was. I found my first seeker token. I'm being up here. Uh, up here, actually, I think it was. Okay, so I can definitely find this. And I'm sitting here thinking about these riddles. I have no idea how to figure out who her parent is. I'm pretty sure I can't bring a griffin to her, even though it has, like, two or three parts, right? Okay. Um, and then... A finder's token. As far as bringing my beloved and stuff. Am I supposed to use the file I just got? I don't know. I don't know. And like bottle somebody up? And then who do I bring? Who do I consider beloved? Do I need to woo someone before I can finish it? I mean, Ragnall's the only one I've given anything to. I mean, I was totally going to woo Brant for sure. Except that like he's so serious and he's all quest first and stuff. Hi, lady. Lady, hi. Come to test your wits. Illumination. Seeker's tokens are yes. treasures indeed. Yet where was it that you found your first? Ah, I see I need... There you go. <laughs> She's doing the thing again. Well sought and well found. Thank you. It's super comfortable. As promised, you shall have your prize. Thank you, creepy lady. Outstanding. She did the pupil dilation thing again, and it's creepy. Yes! Actual fairy stones. So then there's the parent riddle, there's the give me stuff in your backpack riddle, and there's the beloved riddle. And presumably, if I get those three, this one opens. Presumably. Okay. So we knocked out two of them. She seemed like she was going to eat us a couple of times. But we're alive. And that's good. And we killed our first dragon. So that was super cool. Oh man, that was scary. I don't know. Do I just give her the port crystal? I think that's going to be a good stopping point for today. Oh my gosh, this is nerve wracking with the Sphinx. I'm so scared I'm going to screw it up. I, even if I walk back to town, I need to get back and I need to do a hard save. Maybe I will do that. Maybe I'll leave the port crystal here and do a hard save and see how that goes. Oh my gosh. Um, I was not anticipating all of that when, look, we still, we didn't get to any of this stuff because of this. That's okay. That's okay. We will pick up and try to figure this out the next time. It'll give me a little bit of time to chew on what I'm supposed to do there. I'm going to presume if I shove Ragnall in a bottle and bring him here that she probably won't eat him. Probably. <sighs> I don't know. She stresses me. She stresses me. Because she looks super cool at first and then she does that like bird head crank with the feral cat eyes thing and it's I feel like she's going to eat my face. But all the same. Thank you guys for hanging out with me and I will see you next time and we will see if we can get to the bottom of the rest of these riddles. So y'all take care.